Hey guys, welcome to another Today in History. Today in History, in 1825, the United States House of Representatives elected John Quincy Adams as the sixth president of the United States. It had been a four-way election, and the two who got the most votes in the Electoral College were Andrew Jackson and John Quincy Adams, but neither one of them got the 131 electoral votes needed to be elected president. And so when there's uh, a plurality but not a majority, then the election goes to the House of Representatives. Each uh, state delegation gets one vote. So Ohio gets one vote, Pennsylvania gets one vote, all the congressmen and women would vote in that situation. Uh, and then their vote would go to one candidate. John Quincy Adams got the most votes in the Electoral College. It had happened once before in 1800 when they chose Thomas Jefferson over Aaron Burr. But Jackson got his revenge four years later when he defeated John Quincy Adams in the election of 1828.